Last April, my three friends and I went on a cruise that took us to the islands of Vanuatu. We visited Port Vila, Champagne Bay and Luganville. First up was Port Vila where we met our guide Manu from Atmosphere Tours. Okay everyone, this, this guy said they're not going to eat us today, <laughs> so that's good. He first took us to a traditional village where we learnt about their culture. <laughs> Then we went to a school where the kindergarten kids sang songs for us. Wash my face, wash my teeth, comb my hair, I look in. We then went to a turtle sanctuary and saw baby turtle hatchlings as well as some more mature turtles. The great thing about this sanctuary is that you're allowed to pick up and hold the turtles and even swim with them in a pond. Okay. Whoa. Is, that, is this a small one? Yeah, this is about three years old. On day two, we cruised over to Luganville. We met our guide Edna and her husband from Santos Number no. 1 Tours. Our full day tour started with Lowerton Cultural Village, where we saw a magical water music show. literally beat and pound the water to make music. Next we visited Riri Blue Hole which is 15 minutes northwest of Luganville. These blue holes are naturally occurring and they're formed by mineral water that comes up from the ground. The base of the holes is limestone and it's the limestone that causes the transparent water to be iridescent blue. Yeah. <laughs> Are you sure the best way is to just go in? That seems really cold. <laughs> the last stop on our tour was Oyster Island. This island is a great place to snorkel and see lots of sea cucumbers in the water. Turn around over here for us to have a look at. <laughs> it's massive and it's squirting water out. That's well, exciting. that is the biggest sea cucumber I have ever seen. On our last day, we finished up at Champagne Beach in Santo. Locals have markets set up selling the usual brightly coloured garments and souvenirs. They will braid your hair for about 10 baht. Okay, do I look nice? Oh, very, very manly. We had a whole day here, so Edna and Wass took us over to Port Orly, which is about a 15 minute drive away. It's a beach full of coral and sea life, and it was our favourite snorkelling spot. <laughs> 